Hello everybody, today we are going to be attempting to fearfully play Crossbridge. Original puzzle design by Tio, with already undoubtedly beautiful looking hammerizationalization by the very skilled Totes Amazeballs. So a very big thank you to the both of them. Uh, I say, oh, hold on one second. An elevator has arisen, indicating we should pay attention to our exit, which is always very nice to be shown right at the start. Uh, yeah, I say fearfully, because I've been putting this one off for quite some time, even though, well, yeah, it does look absolutely gorgeous. Uh, I've been putting this one off because in the description, it says its difficulty is, and I quote, The Last Crusade. Now, to me, I don't know about you, but to me, that kind of suggests this one may be a tad bit on the wee side of tricky. Because that doesn't really suggest easy, does it? No, it does not. You are right there. Um, so you have been warned now that this one will probably be quite a long video. But you should watch it anyway, because look at it. It's it's clearly beautiful. That is the skybox from Infra, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. I do believe that is the skybox from Infra, which always looks really nicely done with this eerie evening above aperture kind of style. Beautifully lit as to be expected, and a gigantic drop into the cavern of death. Okay, um, right, what we can we actually do other than acknowledge how gorgeous this looks already? We've got a light bridge activating laser receiver here. No panel adjacent. There's another light bridge emitter there. Again, no panel adjacent. There is a laser receiver below. Is that the laser receiver? That is, in fact, the laser receiver for the elevator. So it's going to be one of those, get the elevator down, get on the elevator, then budge things about so the elevator goes back up tight puzzles. Remember that and scream it at me later when I completely forget what we're trying to do. Because, yeah, uh, you can probably tell this one does make me kind of nervous. Uh, where can we actually get from here? There is a panel in there behind glass. It does have an opening there. And runway style tracks on the floor. To indicate a light bridge out of here. Uh, neither of these light bridges have adjacent panels. So maybe a laser out of there at some point. Laser receiver there is for that light bridge. And everything else is all the way along the cavern. So let's go over there then. Uh, do you burn... Nope, you're a quality of life non-burning laser. This lets us get over to this side. Panel lifts up there. And it is a totes amazeball hammerization, meaning I should pay attention to things that move. You're important. You are important, aren't you? Should I... Hold on, if you're blue there... That's why you wanted to move so that I paid attention, right? So that we tried you now and saw that laser can go all the way through that glassed off room up there which is how we get that light bridge there doesn't help me a great deal right now but I'm sure it's very very important to the puzzle uh, I do see a cube delivery tube activated button with a tube above it so let's go press that button we tend to need those especially since there's lasers in here does that mean you are in fact a laser redirection you are you will be most handy all right what can I do with you? Uh, I'm already thinking of things to do with the title, right? Especially since I've just been reminded by this cross here. Cross bridge. At some point, that will be an important hint. Also, as those light bridges cross over. Can only have one at a time, though, right? Is there anywhere else to get another cube delivery tube activated from? No, you're going to be respawned a whole bunch. Hello, interestingly illuminated hole in the wall. Is that for me to find special things? No, just, just lovely lighting detail. There is a lot of places to look for possible places to go, though. Actually, you know what? This reminds me of that map that I cheesed ages ago and promised I'd come back to one day and again, never did because, well, I also fear that one. Um, Springtime? Is it springtime? That had this same sort of uh, style, but with a great big waterfall. That was also a Totes Amazeballs map, right? Or a Totes Amazeballs hammerization? Yeah. Okay, this is going to be a very difficult map. Um, You are at this level though, right? So you there. That is how we get the all-important end elevator down. 
and then somehow move the lasers so that you're no longer there, but doing it from up there. All right, that's going to be important as well, but what else can we actually do from here? Um, that's pretty much it from down here, right? If you're out the way here, we can have... Hold on, double check. We can have you up there, which would give us that light bridge. I can't see any of those panels we used in the first place up there because inconvenience purposely designed blocking panels are in place. But the fact that you go through there means I want to get up in there and look at what we can do in there. Uh, to get back up in there then, we've got to have you be able to do that. Which means I need to be able to have a portal on you, but I need that portal to be able to get anywhere else. So we need... That light bridge? Does that light bridge give us an angle to see that one? But to get that light bridge, we need the laser receptor up there, and that's at a funny angle, so we're going to need you. Uh, which means I want to get back up there with cube in hand. So let's take you over to here. Can I do anything with you? Here. Now, you've blocked off the uh, elevator lowering panel there. You do go back at a bunch of panels there, right? So we could sort of aim at any of those. Would there be any reason to aim at any of those? It gives us an angled laser. Does it give us an angled laser that's any use up there? I mean, I can't see. And when you can't see, it tends to mean no. Plus up there way off. Completely useless compared to what you were doing before. So I don't think there's any point of you being on here. No, that's way too low. Um, I want to get you back up the top there though. So let's put you up there. Orange on you and take you up to this level. That brings the laser up here. It also lets us do that, which gives us a light bridge here. Does this let us get a view? It does. That lets us get a view of that panel. Which means we can activate that one, which is where the title comes into... Ooh, nice flow of broken sewage pipe. Uh, that's where the title comes into play, right? Because cross-bridging. By doing that horrible, horrible thing where you have to pray that light moves at a speed fast enough to get back under your feet before you drop to your death. Um, so that means we probably got to cross back and forth a lot, right? Yeah. So I can swap these? If I'm lined up with you, that's where the light bridge will hopefully hopefully come under my feet if I remember to move the right portal, which is, please work. Yeah, that. I hate, hate doing that. I mean, it's a cool mechanic, but every single time my asshole clenches horribly. Uh, that lets us get over into this glassed off area up here where you've got markings that clearly indicate cube sits here. All right, so if a cube sat there, cubes can laser in that direction, cubes can laser in that direction. So a laser can go straight through a cube. I can also see you from here. And science means laser, as indicated here, goes through glass. So cube goes there at some point. Meaning we need to get the cube in here. Um, I can't bring you in here though, can I? Because you're... You have to be there for me to be able to get in here. Can I swap back? I mean, I'm sure I can swap back because that's, you know, how the mechanics work. But actually, this is the more dangerous one, isn't it? Because I can't remember exactly where you were. You know what? Let's just quick save here. And blue on, it was on the line. Please, please be in a good place. Oh, thank fuck for that. Yes, okay. So we can go back and forth like that, uh, which makes me want to line you up. Actually, you know what? If it's on the line, as long as I remember it's on the line, that will work. Okay, you described the difficulty as the last crusade. Am I overreaching or is this an Indiana Jones reference? Is this the whole... You must have faith, my boy, in a, in a much more Scottishy accent. Because, you know, the invisible bridge where we had to have faith by double check. Yeah, I, I'm going to mess up which portal at some point, aren't I? No, it's not that one. That would have been very stupid. Uh, please, please still work. Yeah, that 
Is that the you must have faith, my boy part? Or am I completely overreaching? It's possible. I tend to do that. Um, so if I wanted to get a cube in here, it must need a cube in here. It indicates cube in here via floor markings. So if I wanted a cube in here, uh, we can do that. We can get a cube in here by going this way. And we could respawn a cube. That will let us take one up into that room there, although it loses the panel up there. But it gets a cube one step closer to where I want a cube, so I'm going to do it. And yeah, uh, you could totally sit there, right? And you could give us the first light bridge, but you'd block the second light bridge. Now, if you were there, the laser would go straight through you. But we can't have the first light bridge. Also, I can't have any light bridge right now. Because I can't get back to over there. I don't need to get back over to there. Do it from here. So if we were using you. And we went down to this level. And I put the blue on you. I can have that one back. But I can't do anything with that one because I'm here. Now, if I move the orange, we can have... No, that would do the same thing, right? Because I've left it in the laser straight through position. Uh, so what if we didn't leave it in the laser straight through position? And we left it in the other light bridge activating position, which is that one there. Head back down this side, put the blue back on, double check, put the blue back on you. And we can have that. Yeah, there's definitely importance in the title of bridges crossing over one another. Unfortunately, they do it when I'm nowhere near them. That's got to be important, right? Though The fact that you can do both from up there. So what can I do with both up there? What, what would make sense to do next? I don't actually know what would make sense to do next. Um, let me go back up in here. Can I get the laser from here? Yeah, okay, you totally give me an angle to see out there as well. Okay, that's... That's good, because that means we can do that stuff from up here. And we can have... Eva Lightbridge from up here as well. So we can have that one, which would let us get back to there. Uh, whilst we're back over here, we can line back up with you. But we can't activate this light bridge from here without, you know, death. Um, actually, we can't activate it at all from here? No, because it has to have the cube there to redirect it in there. But we can do it from in here. If we did it from in here, we can't get back over to where we can cross over, though. So there's something very important takes place in this space, as indicated by you. Yeah, okay. Um, so the laser on you, or out of you. So more crossing over of lasers. So if I did you, that would let us go back to where we were over there. But then we can't have both? I mean, technically you don't have to be in there to do that one. But I can't now have the laser give me the light bridge to get back to there unless you are in there. Does this give a shot to that far panel? If we are all the way over here where it does line up. That will please work. In fact, you know what? Let's quick save again. Please, 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 please. Yeah, okay. That. Still doesn't give me a way to get back over there and I can't move any portals now or we will drop. Um...
Okay, uh, yeah. I've reached the point where I feel like I've discovered a bunch of stuff, but I don't know what to do with any of that stuff. Very beautifully detailed map, though. I do really like this eerie evening above aperture kind of style. Um, has it got a name? It's just sort of the infra skybox, right? Does look great. Love that giant tube of science. Um, so this is important, that you can do all of this in here. Now, I've got you back from there. And I can have either one again, right? So if you're there now, we can have that light bridge again, but we can't get to that light bridge. Get back to where it would let us cross over if you're in there. But then there's no way to swap you back to doing this one. This room is important and it's really starting to bug me that I can feel how important this space is but I don't know what to do with it. The fact you can do this as well, right? You don't technically have to be there. You could be there. But that's the wrong way round. So, you do that one again. There's something I'm missing. Yeah, this is the part of the video where nothing happens for ages because I can't see something. Um, at some point, the cube has to be down on that level. It's the only place to get a laser anywhere near you. So we'd have to get the cube back up to there. Why would I need the cube back up there? Because I can get a new cube down on the level where it needs to be. But I need to be able to get there... ...whilst I'm up here. So, there'd have to be a path from there... ...down to there. With the cube left in the lasers... ...at some point. Yeah, I need to make a... I need to be able to be up there with a path down to there. So why can't I do that whilst I'm over there? Well, for one, I can't really get there now without going the long way around. Also, there's no angle from up there down to there, is there? No, because you have to come out on the light bridge here to be able to see you. You can go the long way, which isn't all that long, by going to you first and then there. But that does that ever so awkward thing of taking one extra portal step, which takes a portal out of the place where you actually need one of them to be left. So, back to this room again. And something to do with this. Oh, 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 okay, um, how do I set that up? We can have you do that one, and then you do that one as you're doing now, which I can then cross-bridge mid-air asshole clenchingly swap from over there. So how do I do that? First, you've got to do that, which gives me this one back. Uh, we know we can do the whole laser throughput thing from over here by praying that I do have that lined up properly. Please, please, please work. Oh, thank fuck. Okay, that. Uh, but then how do I get back to being able to get there? I can move the cube now, right? Because you're still going to maintain... That's how we do it. Okay, I can move the cube because you're still going to maintain that. 
Uh, we then move you along a bit and do the 45 degrees of science over there. That's how we can swap over. Okay, that that's clever and kind of cheeky. Um, yeah, you don't often use the laser through a cube in a straight line thing. And now, if everything's lined up properly, please, please. Oh, thank fuck for that. Yeah, every single time. Um, right, yeah, that is a big deal. Let's get over here and quick save since we've discovered that and then try and work out how that's any use whatsoever. Um, yeah, that, that's a really big deal. I'm going to quick save again because, yeah. Um, that's important. That's probably going to be have to be done again whilst we get back. Can I get back? I can get back over there now, can't I? Because we can leave... Who can I? Can I? I mean, we could go over here. And I could totally use that panel, but if I move any portals now, drop to death. Drop to death would be bad. Um, so, how to use that? Oh, that is definitely something, but I don't know what to do with it. Uh... I also can't cross bridge now. No, we could cross bridge again because we could line up here. Put the orange back on that panel, which would give me this one here again. So let's try that. Let's hope everything's in the right place. Double check which portal's which. Please work that. Hate that. Um. So yeah, I mean, technically from here, we can cross bridge at will. That's a big deal. What can I do with it? Um, where would I want to go next? I need to be able to leave a portal there. Leaving a portal there, though, means I can't get back to there because that's ultimately what I think I need I need a I need a path from here down to there so there's something else to do with the cube this is important I suppose we could technically go back up to here uh, by moving the blue, we lose all the light bridges, but we can get back into this room here. So what's the point of being able to come back up here? It gives me a path back and forward from this bit. You could come back and still hit you. But then that needs the laser to come out of that panel to be of any use. But I can't know because we've got access to the laser here, right? Since we've left a portal up here. But then I can't get back again? The blue on you. And I can have that one back. But then I can't get over there. But we can see that panel from up there. So do that whilst we're there. But what good is that? Plus, I've kind of screwed things up now, haven't I? Um, but you back there for the moment gives me this one again. 
doing that one again meant we could go back to where we can cross over here. And from here, we can swap back to double check everything's lined up and which portal is which. Also, out of nervousness, check that you are, you are, yeah, you are within the square. Okay, uh, let's cross bridge here again. Double check. Orange, please, please work. Thank you. It's like that. Then what we did was we went over into here and we moved you out of the square, but remained in line with that panel at the back so that you can go there and we can cross bridge over here again. Because if we cross bridge over here again, we can get back to that side. So double check, just a little bit more, a little bit, a little bit less about there. Uh, there. When it disappears from view completely there, that is the most asshole clenching of all times it happens. Um, so from up here, I can see that panel. So what is it then? Let's put the blue back on you. Move you back into line with both panels that can give us a laser. But let's not move the laser yet. Let's move the laser from back up here to you. Puts that back on. With that back on, that lets me get to the panel all the way over here. Oh, this is going to be bad if it doesn't work. Uh, it should work though, right? Because you're in the right place. So moving orange to you. You know what? Let's quick save. Moving orange to you maintains this. That that gives me a path over there. Oh, fuck yeah. Okay, uh, that gives me a path over there. So then with a path over there we could put the blue... We lose light bridges, though. Okay. I think I can do all that again. But this does give me a path into here. Path into here is what I've been trying to get. Ooh, I like that shadow slightly wobbling there. Uh, path into here I've been trying to get. Can't go back out that way, though. No. Um... So what did I want a path down here? I wanted a path down here so that we could get a new cube and we can do you. And if we do you whilst we're down here, let's, um... You know what? I quick saved up there somewhere, didn't I? If this doesn't work, I will I will jump off into the crevasse. Uh, let's get a new cube. Right, and then I could have you. Which brings the all-important elevator down. Now let's do... let's not mess up which portal's which. Let's do orange on you. Now that lets me get back up here and lets me get to the actual elevator. Now we just need to find a way to shift that so that the elevator goes back up again. Right. Uh, puzzle phase two or three. Possibly three. Maybe even four. Um, so that's permanent, right? That's always going to line up like that. So the shifting has to be done via portals being shifted about, which means it's got to go through a laser. Go through a laser, it's got to go through a portal. The laser's got to go through a portal and still hit you there. But it has to be on this level. So the only places it can come through... Oh, okay. Um, hold on. You... No, that doesn't help. Uh... What's the point of the laser going up there now? Is there any at all? There's no point in the laser coming up here now, is there? 
No, so it's got to be done from down here somehow. You can go straight across to there, but then I can't use you. I need a way back up. I have to be able to maintain a path from here. So is it something similar to what we did up there? So if I did you straight through... Doesn't help either. I can move the blue once I'm up there, right? So if you were not in that laser, but in fact just in line with the portal. And I move the blue. Hold on, double check. Yeah, move the blue to you. I think that's it. Oh, okay, well, yeah, um, then it's just a case of shifting the portal, right? Which is what we were trying to do all along. Let's let's quick save just in case. Uh, blue, and please rise me to the exit, yeah. Okay, that. That is some clever reusing uh, laser and portal position, plus light bridges and the whole mid-air crossing thing level design. That. Very, very clever, Tio. Well done. And, of course, very, very nice hammer work to totes amazeballs. Now, is this the actual end? It kind of feels like the end, and I kind of hope it is because my brain's a bit fried. Is that an exit elevator? Looks like a more interesting than usual exit elevator. I believe this might actually be the end now, though. Is this it? Ah, thanks for playing. Well, thank you very much for making it. That was uh, definitely very, very nicely done. That was Crossbridge. Original puzzle design by the ingenious Tio, with, as always, beautiful hammerizationalization by the very skilled Totes Amazeballs. So a very big thank you to the both of them, and a big thank you to Hugo B. Designer for the recommendation. I feel like we've done some proper science here tonight. I feel like we've really forded Aperture's cause. Now, if only I could remember what Aperture's actual cause was. Um, it's, it's, it's something to do with cubes, right? Thank you very much for watching. Catch you later.